In today's video, you will learn how to create a grungy text animation in After Effects in a few minutes. By the way, you can download this After Effects project file from the link in the description below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so we are in After Effects. Let's create a new composition. Give it a name, whatever you want. And here you can see my composition settings on the screen. So first of all, I'm going to select a text tool to add a text like this and then align it. After that, I'm going to add a new solid layer, name it as a background. And then I place it below the text layer. After that, I select both layers and pre-compose them. Name it as a text. And after that, I am going to create a new solid layer. Name it as Blur Comp. Then I am going to add an effect called Four Color Gradient to this layer. Now you can see the color points, which we can manipulate. So first I change color 1 as white. And then I change the second color to black. And so on. Next, I reposition the color point like this. And then I want to animate the color points. So to animate this, I click on the point 1, 2, 3 and 4th stopwatch to create a keyframes. You can see the keyframes here. Then I go to the 1 second mark and change the color point position just like this. So it will animate. After that, I repeat this process and animate the color points manually like this. So we got this kind of results. After that, I'm going to turn off the visibility of this layer. And after that, I'm going to add a new adjustment layer into this timeline. Let's rename this as Blur Controller. And after that, I'm going to search an effect called Compound Blur and add it to this layer. Let's see the settings. So first I change the blur layer as blur comp. Then I change source as effects and mask. So you can see certain point of this text is blurred. And if I play the previews, you can see how it will look. One more thing I'm going to show you. If I select the blur comp layer and then I select the effect to visible the color points in our composition, so you can see the white color is responsible to the blur amount. So we can control the blur by the white color point. Let's move forward. So right now I'm going to add a new adjustment layer. Let's rename it as FX. And then I search effect called noise. Then add it to this layer. Let's increase the noise amount around 35%. And make sure you uncheck the Use Color Noise option. And now you can see a grungy look applied to our text. Looks good, right? After that, I search effect called Tritone and then add it to this layer. Let's change the mid-tone color to a greenish color. And if I choose a darker color, so it will lower the grunginess. And if I select the lighter color, so it will increase the grunginess. So you can also control the grunge effect by this color adjustment. And after that, I search curves effect and add it to this layer to give it a final touch. And lastly, I search glow effect and add it to this layer. Then I change the threshold to 90%. And then I change the glow radius to 30%. Now you can see it will give this text a little bit polished look. And after that, I'm going to add one last solid layer, call it grid. And then I place it just above the text layer. After that, I search a grid effect and add it to this layer. Then I decrease the opposite value to around 30%. Or maybe it should be 22% for better look. And now it looks perfect. So that's how you can create a grungy text animation in After Effects. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.